ducks. All right. Uh, time starts as soon as I gain control, so I'll just do a short countdown and then do it. Let's go. Three, two, one, go. So this is Fallout 1. Uh, combat's actually slow, so we're just going to go ahead and skip it. There's a little trick you can do where uh, if you manually start combat, since it's uh, it's a turn-based combat system that's not always active, uh, you have a free turn to just kind of do whatever you want. And I'm going to use that whole turn to just move. And then, excuse me, I clicked on the thing. And then after combat, there's a very, very, very short time where combat won't, or AI won't activate, and then you can just start combat again. And you can use that to just run past everything. And I might be doing that for literally the entire run. We'll see. Oh, whoops. That, uh, that mole rat almost got me. So, there's actually not very many shots fired from guns in this run. So I'm going to be firing some shots at Fallout 4, because that game fucking blows. So there's one shot right now. The writing in Fallout 4 fucking sucks, alright? The UI design in Fallout 4 is atrocious. I hate it so much. The dialogue system is crap. It's just so dumb. All right, now we have actual plot. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna make RTA saves. Let's do that. Yeah, that might be smart. All right, actual stuff to talk about. So I uh, got teleported down to this main base, and this guy wants to punch me in the face. But if I actually just run away, he uh, he gets really can. I failed to pick. Why can't I pick locks today? Oh my god! Please, please. Please pick the lock. This is normally first try. Jeez. Alright. So if I run away from the guy, he gets very confused and just kind of stands there. And I grabbed a bomb. This is sort of a shot. You could, you could call this... Call, call this shot... Fire... Shot... Shotting a fire. This is... I'm gonna shot a fire right into this guy's pocket. And, uh... He's just going to kind of blow up. And fortunately for us, the nice little robes he was wearing are completely unexploded and totally fine. So we're going to put them on. And uh, now we're disguised. So now nobody actually cares about us. Oop. I can stop now. Oh, uh, no. i got to go fast. I can't stop now. Because right now I'm going to do some science. You don't want to stop science. All right, I signed to the terminal, and now I can set the base to self-destruct. Robes are explosion-proof. It's pretty convenient. So I just set the whole base to self-destruct, so all of the shots are going to be fired against all of the people inside of this place because they're going to blow up. Rip them. This guy tells us to leave. So we should probably do that. And uh, I'm going to remember to use a heal. These uh, these force fields actually hurt you. Normally I have more health so I don't have to worry about dying to the first couple. But I did something special for you guys. So I actually have less health right now. So I'm just going to make sure to heal up. They can do like up to 30 damage. They normally don't, but just in case. Oh, you're all nerds. Look at all these nerds over here just standing around, like all nerdy. Such nerds. Uh, this guy says we should probably go in and introduce ourselves to the lieutenant, so we're going to do exactly that by walking the opposite direction. I'm sure it's fine. Don't worry about it. Um, yeah. And, uh, boom. They're all dead. I just fired all of the metaphorical shots by blowing them all up. Uh, hopefully these guys won't fire any shots at me, because they can brutally murder me, and it's actually really scary. Uh, 
All right, back to Fallout 4 and why it's absolutely terrible. They just decided to like throw a bunch of new mechanics in for no reason and they didn't polish any of them. The UIs for all of them are terrible. They're all stupid. They're not well explained at all. I got through the entire game and found like glitches and stuff before I knew there was a cover mechanic or a weight mechanic built into the game, which is completely ridiculous because it just doesn't even explain anything. It's so stupid. It's such a poorly made game. It's got lots of terrible, terrible bugs. Also, I'm taking... This perk is just for... That's not the right one. Whatever. All right, we're not going to do any safety. But I do need a whole bunch of lockpick and speech. There's one thing that the law needs. It's speech. We're going to do like a little bit extra just in case. So this is the cathedral. Uh, the guys with the robes that I'm currently wearing are from here. So I'm just going to blend right in. There's a cover mechanic. There's a cover mechanic in that if you walk up to a corner and you scope in, it'll lean around the corner for you. That's the cover mechanic, and it just literally never tells it tells you about it. Alright, so this guy leads the cathedral. We're gonna go talk to him. We're gonna yell a bunch of words in his face really quickly. And he's gonna take us down to the master. Now the master is like this big glop of flesh and mechanical stuff, and he's really gross, and I don't want to talk to him. So I'm just gonna run away. That's a much better solution, I think. So now we're at third level of this vault. We still need to deal with the master, right? He's he's the bad guy. We need to fight the bad guy. So uh let's fight the evil bad guy. How about that? I'm going to fight him by running away from him and doing something else. So you notice that I picked up a key when I was in the last area. That key is going to be very useful over here. But I can't just use this terminal because there's some super mutants that will get very mad if I do. But hey, I can just start combat and then use my key on here and then run away before they can actually activate. So now this base is also self set to self-destruct. And all of these goddamn nerds are going to get wrecked. I think this is a pretty effective way of uh, murdering everything. Uh, now I need to get out of here quick. And to do that, this helpful person is going to kick us out. There, we're outside and we're going to leave. So, fun fact about this game. Hey, hey, hey hockey. Time stops on the first actual shot of the game, which is coming up right now. That's not normally when it stops, but it, that that's when we'll stop it here. Alright, so we just have this conversation. This uh, overseer who kicked you out at the beginning, he's just telling you that you can't come back in because of reasons. And we don't like that, right? So we're going to fucking shoot him. Boom! Shot fired. That's time. This is a shot fired marathon, right? There. Shot was just fired. There you go, guys. Shot fired. We did it. We did it, guys.